I buy power, I buy problems. I'm just joking. I see more of these in my shop than other PCs because they're popular with people who don't work on their own stuff. So when something breaks, they bring it here. And this flashy box of cut corners is here because it won't boot and it's giving a RAM error. So obviously the first thing we check is the RAM. Pop it out for a visual inspection and Neo Forza. Huh, I've never seen that brand before. Well, it looks fine, so let's try a different slot. Still nothing. All right, let's try one of my RAM sticks. Awesome. Let's reseat the CPU and then forget to film it. Same problem. But wait, what is this? I've made a few videos on why to avoid these eight data drives due to reliability issues. So let's see what happens when I remove it and slap in another drive. Moment of truth. Uh... Actual moment of truth. Well, there you have it. Just to be sure, I plugged the drive into our totally stable, high-tech, top-of-the-line cloning station and confirmed it's completely f***ed. But does anyone know why it was causing a DRAM error? Let me know in the comments.